What's going on, everybody? It's your Bob and Fitness Day Hashtag Gains. Before I start this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, stay up to date with all my fucking videos, follow me on Instagram and Apple Fitness, and follow my band, Divided Dimension, on Spotify. Everything you need to know will be in the description box below. Give the video a thumbs up, does it cost you guys a fucking penny, and it does help the channel grow, so I would appreciate it if you hit the thumbs up button. Let's get to, uh, well, without further ado, let's get to the review. All right, so Swolverine, shout out to Swolverine for sending me over their, a couple of their products to review. This is their Whey Isolate, and this is their Chocolate Milkshake flavor. Um, So let's go ahead and get into uh, the price point. The price point on this bad boy is $53 on their website, Um, and that is for 30 servings. If you use the coupon code Opperman Fitness, it will get you 10% off, bringing this down to like $47 for 30 servings. Which ends up being around $1.60 a serving um, for an isolate. Um, I'd say that's definitely in the medium to uh, expensive range. Um, so it's definitely not, you know, like super cheap. It's definitely not in the middle of the road. It's definitely in the middle to the high uh, expensive road, basically. Um, so that's the price point. When you're looking at the label here, you have one scoop at 30 grams, 110 calories, 0.5 fat, two sugars or two carbs, one sugar, 26 grams of protein. You have a little bit of calcium and sodium in here. So you got a little bit of electrolytes. You have a digestive enzyme blend, 10 milligrams of pepepane and protease. And then when you look at the ingredients, it's whey protein isolate, Dutch alkalized cocoa powder, natural and artificial flavor, xanthan gum, and sucralose. So super clean label, super, um, very clean. I mean, there's really not much ingredients in here. So it says build, re build, rebuild, recovery and then it also says uh, whey protein isolate plus two to one one bcaas i guess they threw some bcaas in here to me it doesn't really do much for me i don't really know why companies even do that to be honest with you it is what it is um it says uh mix for one scoop for eight ounces and let's go ahead and try it out already got it ready to roll shorten the shorten the time on the Shorten the time on the video. I know you guys are busy. I know you guys are busy. So I got eight ounces in here. I got one scoop. Boom. Look at that. One scoop. All right. All right, here we go. Taste test time. Cheers. I think I did too much uh, almond milk. Oh yeah, eight ounces. I actually had like 10. So I'm gonna throw a little bit of powder in there. Just a little bit. Nothing crazy. I just want to be fair about my rating. Man, my nose is itching. All right, here we go. Retaste test time. Okay. It's less, uh, it's less watery tasting, even though it's used with almond milk. It's a very... Conventional style chocolate. It's not bad by no means. It's actually like smooth. It's easy to drink. It's not, um, it's not gonna knock your socks off with taste, but it's not bad. I have no problems drinking this, you know. It's a good chocolate though, it is. It's not super eventful though. It's not an eventful type of chocolate. It's just like a very standard type of taste. But honestly, I've had a lot of standard ones that I didn't like, and I actually like this one. It's it's just easy to drink. It's almost like you're drinking it, and you're not really worried about the taste, you know, but it's not offensive or anything. But it's also not like too plain where you don't like it. It's it's just it's just it's just a very average taste, but it's not bad by no means. Pretty solid, honestly. Not the best chocolate I've ever had in my life, by no means. You could tell it's clean. Like, you could tell it's, like, very minimal ingredients. 
there's like fucking five ingredients in this. So, I mean, you could tell. It's just very to the point type of taste. Not bad at all, though. Yeah, not bad. This is a very, very, um, very standard. Not bad. Clean, easy to drink. It's not going to knock your socks off in taste, um, but it's not bad. So as far as ratings, um, um, it's, it's, mm, I'm going to give that a 7.5. It's a very standard flavor. Not bad by no means. 7.5. Um, and then that, that's gonna be pretty much it. I, I think it's pretty solid. It's just a uh, very standard type of taste. I do want to thank Swolverine for sending this over and give me the opportunity to review it on my channel. I really appreciate it. If you guys want to check out any of their products, go to uh, their website. It'll be the very first link in the description. Make sure you guys use Opperman Fitness in case you guys do want to buy anything from their website and uh, check them out. Uh, there's a couple more products I got to review from them. So make sure you guys stay tuned. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, share, like it, all that good shit. And other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. It will be in the description box below. Everything you need to know will be in the description box below. And other than that, guys, I'll check you guys later. Yeah.